today as you drive growth, more and more data touch points are being created, updated, and consumed than ever before. And these touch points can live in your engagement system, your mobile app, or your data warehouse. Ensuring the quality of this data and keeping these touch points relevant to your customers in real time becomes chaotic as you collect more and more data. But it doesn't have to be. Let me show you how MParticle can help. MParticle provides the foundational infrastructure for data ingestion, data verification, governance, and real-time segmentation so you can activate the right data with the application that best fits your needs. Applications such as Braze. Braze is a customer engagement platform powering relevant and memorable experiences between customers and the brands they love. But a memorable experience is only as good as the most up-to-date data about that customer. Let me show you how MParticle's bi-directional integration with Braze ensures you have the most up-to-date information about your customer. Here we have various data touch points. In MParticle, we've used this data to create a unified profile of a customer. Using this profile, we'll build out an audience that we can then send over to Braze along with events. Braze can utilize this information in Canvas to execute a campaign across multiple channels, then take the results of this campaign and send it back to MParticle via Braze Currents. Once it's back in MParticle, user profiles can then be updated with new data points, giving you a closed loop that'll continually update your customer profiles. Take a look at it in action. We have Jane Doe here using the mobile app in our e-commerce store. She'll first sign into the app and give consent for marketing analytics. And then Jane will view and search some products. In the MParticle live stream, we can see that all this is being recorded. Jane Doe can also view a promotional video, which then shows up in live stream. Let's check out the user profile for Jane Doe. Here we can see her customer ID, email address, and source, which is iOS. We can also see Jane's consent for marketing analytics. Because Jane watched our promotional video, she was automatically added to the first time buyer audience, which has an ID of 37555. If we look into that audience criteria, we can see that users in this audience have shared their email address, have an empty LTV, have watched our promotional video, and have given consent for marketing. Now take a look at the connections. Here we can see our Braze connection is configured to send audiences. So far, we've collected everything in MParticle, defined a user and attributes, and added that user to an audience that will be sent over to Braze. Now, let's take a look at the Braze dashboard. Here in Braze, we'll first search for our user using the user ID. We can see here all the user information is synchronized as well as the audience membership to audience 37555. For this audience, we've configured an email campaign. We can see the rules of this campaign, which will send an email based on a play event. Let's go ahead and go to Jane Doe's inbox, and we can see the marketing campaign email sent from Braze. We'll click the link in the email and purchase an item. Now let's jump back to MParticle and take a look at the live stream. All of the events from Braze and the mobile app have been recorded. We can see Jane opened the campaign email, clicked on the link in the email, and made a purchase converting to a customer. With MParticle serving as the foundation of your customer data infrastructure, customer data becomes actionable across the entire company. Our over 300 out-of-the-box integrations are continuously optimized and improved so you can take advantage of the latest and greatest features across your entire stack. And Real-Time Audiences gives you the flexibility to build an audience once in MParticle then distribute that audience across your connected integrations. To learn more about how MParticle can power your data activation with the right data, be sure to check out mparticle.com/usecases. Thanks for watching.